Hey folks, Joey Kasimi here with IncomePress.com and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to edit your tab icons for your Facebook timeline pages and your profile pages. Now there's three things I'm going to show you how to do and one of them is how to change the actual image to that specific tab icon. The second thing is I'm going to show you how to change the name to that tab icon so you can name it whatever you want. And the third thing I'm going to show you how to do is how to get or how to find the link to that specific tab. So if you created an opt-in page or a reveal like page or something, you could actually tell uh, direct people to that specific link uh, so they could go ahead and opt in or like your page or whatever call to action you have. So I'm gonna show you how to do that. So let's go ahead and proceed with the tutorial. The first thing I'm gonna show you how to do is actually how to find the link to the tab, which is the easiest thing to do. So the first thing you want to do is just go ahead, if you have a whole ton of apps like I do here, uh, you'll see little numbers here of how many you got left or, or that's hidden. Just go ahead and click on that. And the one that we're going to be working with today is this one here, which is just a static HTML plugin that I use to create my Facebook opt-in pages. Now to, to find the link to this uh, tab, just go ahead and hover over it, cl click on this pencil icon. You're gonna see a little menu pop up and just go ahead and scroll down and find the one that says linked to this tab. Just go ahead and click on it. A little uh, box will pop up or hover over your timeline page and this is the actual uh, link to that specific tab. Okay, so all you gotta do is just take this, uh, put a URL shortener on it, put it on a bit.ly or a bud URL, whatever you want. Uh, direct traffic to it people will click on it go to your opt-in page and, and opt in okay so that's how you find the link to that specific tab and you could do that for any one of these here okay so i'm just going to go ahead and click on okay to to get rid of it the second thing i'm going to do i'm going to show you how to do is how to change this name here okay you see it says welcome that's like ugly so i want to uh, change the name to that okay so the same thing just hover over it click on this little pencil icon and then right down here, click on this uh, little edit settings, a little tab here. It'll take you to this uh, menu here. And right here where it says custom tab names, just go ahead and put whatever uh, you want there. Okay, just make it short, simple and sweet. Click on save, then click on okay. And you'll see it, uh, the name change uh, instantly, okay? So the third thing I'm gonna show you how to do is how to change the actual icon image. And as you can see, it's got a real ugly gray star there. So again, go ahead and click on this little pencil uh, icon, click on the edit settings. It's a little message will pop up again. And all you gotta do is right here where it says custom, custom tab image, go ahead and click on this change. Once you're here, just go ahead and click on this change uh, little link here again. <laughs> Facebook doesn't uh, make it easy, do they? Uh, right here, just go ahead and click on Browse and find wherever your uh, your image is, uh, is is placed at, whatever folder. I'm going to use this one image here, which is just a video player because my opt-in page is a video. So I'm going to go ahead and click on Open. Once the image is uploaded, you're pretty much done here. All you got to do is just go back to your uh, timeline page, click on OK here, and then you'll instantly see the image change right there. And as you can see, it looks really nice, pretty, and sexy now. The name has changed. The only thing you won't be able to change is little uh, favicon here. You can't do anything about that. But uh, the most important part, the name and the image uh, is changed. It looks a lot uh, prettier now and more appealing. So that's how you do those three things. That's how you find your link to that specific tab. That's how you change the name to that tab. And that's how you change the image to that specific tab okay so with that said i hope you enjoyed this uh, video tutorial joey kasimi with incompress.com peace i love you for free i'll see you on the next vid